So I'm just going to sort of repeat that last bit. Isn't it odd? We can only see our outsides, but nearly everything happens on the inside. So now by the river, just there, it says here, is there something there? Asked the boy. It's getting dark. Shall we? Um, Good idea. We can set off properly tomorrow, said the mole. Imagine how we would be if we were less afraid, said the boy. Most of the old moles I know wish they'd listened less to their fears and moved to their dreams, replied the mole. What do you dream about? How? said the boy. Oh, what's that like? I don't know. I'm not sure. Hmm. But I know I need one. And now something's coming into the picture. The fox is coming. Oh, golly. He looks hungry, said the mole. He does. It's OK. The fox has gone, said the boy. So it's just gone. What was that sound? asked the boy. I'm not sure. Do you think someone is hurt? Maybe. Should we go and check? Good idea. I'll stay in here to keep you warm. OK, said the boy. Thank you. And there you go. Just got just going to go and see what's going on. It's the fox, said the boy. He's trapped. Sounds like just a trapped fox. There. Oh, dear, whispered the mole. Please be careful, said the boy. I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid, said the mole. So the, the mole is actually going up, up to the up to the fox. If it wasn't, if I wasn't caught in this snare, said the fox, I'll kill you, said the fox. If you stay in that snare, you'll die, said the mole. So the mole chewed through the wire with his tiny teeth. You did so well. And so what happened was that the mole released the fox. Anything from that? This feels like a good cliffhanger point to be leaving as well, Joe. I was hoping you're going to end on a point with a little bit of drama. Because is he now going to get eaten by the fox like, like he promised? Or is he going to be rewarded for letting him go? I think back to the, the theme of the book with kindness being above all else, he's actually, even though he's been threatened, he's still done what, you know, you would say morally is the right thing and freed him from being trapped, which is a good a, thing, but might work out to be a bad thing for him. Yeah, I think it's in those moments, isn't it, where even if you may not like the person, morally... The, the strongest thing you can do is the right thing, although it yeah. might be the hardest thing. And in that clip, he's basically gone off and helped someone who potentially was going to hurt them. Um, and like you said, it's the hardest thing, but I think sometimes as well, there's the reason to not do it isn't because it's hard, it's because it's risky, I suppose. But then if he mm. doesn't, if he just chooses not to do it and he doesn't know what the outcome would be and he walks away, he's got to live with knowing he didn't do anything with it. So there's a bit of me with that. If you are going to, if you would worry about it, then it's almost easier to take the hard decision because it's got the best long-term, well, hopefully the best long-term concept. We don't know, do you? That's the whole, that's it's the an, thing, isn't it? It's I guess it's an unknown outcome against a certainty of knowing you're going to be doubting yourself. It's a tough decision though. And again, it depends on the sort of person you are as well. But if we can practice these things like in the real life, and I can see this sort of coming up for people maybe you don't get along with, maybe there's family members or something. And this isn't so so I think the wire is a metaphor for people, you know, that people may not appreciate you, like you, whatever. But if it came down to the crunch, what would you do? You know, would you still help them or would you just like walk away and just leave them to suffer? And I think this is a really great lesson because I think, you know, if we can get more kindness out there in the world, you know, and do these types of things. And, and sometimes we don't always make the right choices. Like, I know I haven't made the right choice in the past. You know, I've reacted to things where people haven't been too, too kind and I've not been kind back. Is that the right thing to have done? Right. And these are the things, the lessons that I think we need to take away from it. <laughs>